Hey, I'm James Jean. If you haven't seen me before, I do archery trick shots, and these are my tips and tricks. For this trick shot, I'm gonna show you a good beginner trick shot, and that is the pendulum shot. This is a good introductory trick shot, especially when you come from a still target shooting background. So first things first, you wanna take an arrow, put it up top. Next, you wanna get your can or a bottle or a tennis ball, whatever you want, possibly not a tennis ball, because sometimes they bounce back, and uh, some string. You can use any type of string, just something that will support the can. So I got my arrow up here, we're gonna take it, we're gonna tie it up here. It's gonna to be tough with the wind blowing, but our ideal is to have this thing swinging. All right, so we're gonna give it a shot here. Uh, let me go ahead and get my arrow knocked up. The wind's kind of bad. So it's gonna take, it's gotta be real quick. So I'm gonna swing it, come back and shoot it. All right, so that is the pendulum shot. I'm gonna show you some quick tips to, to hit it. All right, so basically with the pendulum, pendulum shot, you know where it's gonna go. It's gonna go right to left, left to right, but as soon as you let go, it's decreasing speed. So with the still target shot, a lot of times you wanna be shooting it where it stops on the left to right hand side. So you just gotta anticipate that's gonna be lower than it was before. So say it, my hand levels up here, let go, it was down here. So you just gotta anticipate that it's gonna be right in this area. And when you first start out, you can always let it, you know, die down before you start shooting it. Now, as far as a moving shot, I like to shoot them Kind of towards the center that's when it's going the fastest at the bottom of the pendulum and uh what i like to do is i like to draw back and a lot of people at the start i see this mistake a lot is they're just aiming for a spot say it's right here there's a red there's a dot right there you're just shooting hoping that you got the timing right to get through the can now to make this more of a consistent shot we're going to take i'm going to pull back i'm going to follow it follow it follow it follow it and shoot and keep keep with the follow through keep going right to left now that last shot i went from right to left and it went and i shot and i kept on going to the left that's how i would normally do it for any type of moving target i would keep going following through i don't shoot and stop but yeah you just want to follow through it so let's uh let's give it another try that was fun i haven't done that in a while So pay attention. I'm gonna hit this thing in slow-mo and you can kind of see what I'm doing here. All right, I'm gonna let go and I'm gonna run back to my spot and I'm gonna shoot it. All right, now I'm gonna find the target. Find it, lead it, fall through. All right, that's how you do it. Let me hit the slow-mo real quick. What I was doing, I knew how fast, I was studying how fast it is swinging and I just led accordingly to it. You don't want to aim where it's at. You want to aim where it's going. So I shot it and then followed through. So that's my tip of the week. Give it a try. You can do it with cans, you know, anything. Just uh, make sure you're safe. Make sure the arrow don't bounce back after you shoot it. And you can do all types of way. You can do it small to big. Uh, you can even shoot the string. That's a fun thing to do too. But it's just a fun thing to do in your backyard. Please give it a try.